Welcome to the channel. In this video, I will show you how to set up Samsung Galaxy A25 by transferring data from your old phone. Let's get started. To begin, turn on your phone. You will get this welcome screen. Select your preferred language by tapping this down arrow icon. It will show all the available languages. Once you are done with your selection, tap OK and then start. For your review, here end user license agreement and privacy policy are mandatory. Sending diagnostic data is optional. You can select it or select agree all. Let me select only the mandatory ones. Is this set up with another device? This interface allows you to set up your new phone using your old Android or iPhone. It will copy settings and accounts from your old phone so that you no need to set it up manually on this new phone. To use this, keep your old phone nearby and unlocked. This is my Galaxy A15. It is nearby and I will unlock it now. As you can see, it opened this pop-up which shows Setup Galaxy A25 5G. So, tap Setup. Now, on your new phone, you will get a QR code and a QR code scanner on the old phone. So, scan the QR code. It is showing continue setup on your new device. It is already started copying the settings. Connecting to Wi-Fi. It already received the credentials of the Wi-Fi network and connected. Getting your phone ready. Wait for few minutes, it will continue the setup. It copied the Google account. We just need to enter the password for verification. It is copying and getting account info. Please wait till it completes the process. Copy data from your Android phone. If you wish to transfer apps, photos, contacts, messages, call history, etc. from the old phone to the new one, tap Next. Get started with Smart Switch. Tap Next. Smart Switch uses these permissions which allows it to transfer the data. So, tap Allow to proceed to the next step. Transfer your data. Select how you want to transfer your data from the old phone to the new one. You get two options, wireless and cable. If you have Wi-Fi connection, you can select wireless. Otherwise, select cable. Let me choose wireless. Connecting to transfer your data. It is showing both devices need to be connected to the same Wi-Fi connection. I have connected to the same Wi-Fi network. It is showing this message as I have not allowed the permission to smart switch in old phone. So let me allow the permissions. Now it is showing continue on your new device. On Galaxy A25, it started showing searching for data to transfer. Once it finishes the scan, it shows this select data to transfer. You can choose between everything, just calls, contacts and messages or custom. You can see what it will not transfer by tapping here. To make this video shorter, I am selecting just calls, contacts and messages. Tap next. It will transfer the data and you will see the screen on both the devices. Google services. Go through them and agree to the ones based on your preference and tap accept. Choose your search engine. You get multiple options to choose from. Let me go with Google. Tap Next. On your old phone, it will show all done once transferring is complete. Tap Done. Protect your phone. Choose what type of lock you want to use. You can select between face recognition, fingerprint, pin, password or pattern. I will do this later in settings. Let me skip this for now. Access your assistant with Hey Google. You can configure it here or you can do it later by tapping skip. 
getting your phone ready please wait getting recommended apps it is showing smart tutor app you can read more about this app here you can keep it or unselect it once you are done with your selection tap next if you want to add samsung account you can do it here by logging in with your credentials if you don't have samsung account or you wish to skip this step tap forgot password or don't have an account here you can create a account or retrieve your account details to skip this step tap set up later in settings it is showing the benefits of having samsung account tap skip if you don't want to sign in customization services you can opt out or keep it based on your preference tap agree to proceed on this page you can choose your display mode light or dark mode let me keep it light tap next it is showing you are all set up tap finish experience samsung services tap agree select the language and proceed to get the samsung curated apps to get installed on your phone you can skip this if you don't want to install these apps exit app setup yes you will get home screen now if you go to the notification area it will show the steps you have skipped while doing the setup you can go back to them to finish them whenever you are convenient to do also it will finish updating and install the apps in the background that's it for this video on how to set up samsung galaxy a25 5g and transfer data from your old phone to the new one Thank you for watching this video please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you find this video informative